Hello all, uh, Sushi here with another uh, Figma review. Uh, today we have Figma 351 Kurosawa Daya? Dia? Yeah. I haven't watched a lot of the uh, Love Live Sunshine. I've watched some of it, but wasn't as uh, into it. I need to finish the series. I think I've finished about half the first season. So here we go with the front of the box. Um, we will go through this and uh, go over her and show you what uh, she looks like. So there's all the uh, different angles of the box. So we will go ahead and uh, open her up and we'll be right back with uh, the figure. Okay, so uh, here she is, out of the uh, box. So, um, I do like the uh, subtle details on here with the uh, clip on the uh, necktie. It is uh, movable, so it does have a little bit of play on it. Uh, everything else, uh, pretty much standard. Uh, the skirt is... Uh, our usual malleable plastic it is split once here in the front and again here in the back to give her uh, the ra uh, range of motion so that the uh, skirt will flare out or move forward uh, she does have a standard pair of brown uh, school loafers that uh, look pretty nice they're uh, nice dark dark brown so that's nice. Uh, her hair uh, is pretty much all in one place. It does move uh, a little bit here on the front and all of this on the back does bend. So be very, be, I'd be a little bit careful with that. So there you go there. Um, not really much different on her. Uh, so she is uh, Pretty standard and she does have a good uh, silhouette there so the uh, head isn't uh, jutting out here like it has on some other uh, Figma that I've done recently or well that I've got videos of so here she is so um like most of the Love Live series Figmas uh, the original series and uh, the new ones they do come with quite a lot of hands so uh, first she has this set of open uh, finger hands where she's just standing there with their open with two of the, the pinky and the forefinger uh, touching. So that's the ones that she comes with default on her. Which isn't normal because they normally have the uh, fists on them. So here we have the first set of hands. So here we have the uh, standard uh, closed fists. You have a set of hands for holding items, mics, bags, any other uh, accessories. You have a set of pointing hand fingers. You have a set of pointing fingers with the thumbs up. So you have thumbs up and thumbs down. So you have those. Uh, four sets of hands and then she has a set of open hands with fingers together she has a set of peace signs for each hand she has this one with the three out she has this hand I would say for holding one of her accessories or optional parts and then she has a set of holding hands so that you can uh, take a couple of the girls, put them together so that they're holding hands. Pretty nice. So there are all of the hands that she comes with. Now uh, for some of her optional parts. Okay, so she does have uh, this standard uh, expression for uh, her, her uh, normal one, which is a gentle smile. So there she has that. 
she has a singing expression so that's that one right there that shows that she's singing she then has a screaming expression uh, which was used when performing the wrestling techniques or having wrestling techniques performed on her so there you go there uh, now for her optional part she uh, doesn't have a lot but she does have, a, have a, some decent ones so she's got a set of bare feet so that uh, you can take the shoes off her and she still has uh, feet on so this is going to be the uh, shin and the uh, feet so you would just pop this out pop the leg off here and place this leg in there to replace pretty much the soft foot and the uh, loafers so you have a set of those you then have a set of pinkish pom-poms that uh, she can use to help if you want to recreate uh, the ending theme so there you have those. She also has her uh, uh, folding fan. So there's that. Uh, one side is blank and the other side has kanji on it. So there's that for her. Uh, she comes with her school bag with its uh, little charms on it and everything. Now on these bags, all of them I've noticed do have uh, malleable plastic on the uh, handles. So it will uh, easily fit in to these hands. All you do is take it at the top and you can move it over the thumb no, on the other ones I can and it fits into the hand so that it can be held like so. Now all her hands are uh, ball joints so as you can tell there's not a peg on the end of this one to give it a... well there went Alexa going off for some strange reason so uh, they do fit in there nicely like that we will, uh, we'll just leave that hand on there for now so she also comes with a power generator so there's that not bad so that'd be where you I guess put in the fuel of whatever type uh, there's your power on different uh, locations for things but not bad looking so there's that now if you uh, pre-order directly from Good Smile you do get uh, an extra item so with that you get a scrunchie which is this little thing right here it's pretty much since it's plastic it is hard so it doesn't bend it is used as a bracelet so it does go around her wrist so we can show you right here so that hand would pop off put that there and then you put the hand back on so there you go there is the scrunchie so uh, she also does come with a extra wrist ball joint so I've got tons of these now because they all come with them and then you have your standard uh, stand so here's this and with the three point or three joint uh, arm so there's for that uh, now she uh, you do get your set of instructions does show how to 
put the fan in your hand, how to uh, use the pom poms because they don't have pegs or anything to hold. So, you do just take the hands off and pop the wrist peg directly into the bottom of the pom poms and they stay on her. So, there is our Japanese side and there is our English side. So all those fun uh, instructions are there. And then you have the standard Figma bag. So that's everything that uh, Curse Idea comes with. And I'm probably pronouncing the second part uh, incorrectly. But I'll have to uh, watch the series again to remember how to pronounce her name. So there's everything she comes with. Uh, quite a few little accessories. Um, stuff that you can set her up with. Don't know how I would set her up with the generator, but I'm sure I can figure something out. But uh, there you go. So if you enjoyed the video, uh, like, comment, and subscribe somewhere on the bottom here. And uh, thanks for watching. So shout out.